Hello everyone and welcome back to Red Dead Redemption 2. We're sitting by the fire drinking coffee through the middle of the night because we can't sleep anywhere. I mean I suppose I could go make a bed out in the bushes somewhere but there were a lot of cougars out there on the way back from uh, town last episode. I saw two cougars and I was like nah let's not. <laughs> So we're just drinking coffee and hopefully that keeps us going for the rest of the day. Um, I re I'm recording this episode directly after the last one. So um, if you guys have answered my question about whether or not there's anywhere to sleep around here, I haven't seen it yet because, yeah, you haven't actually said it yet. But anyway, it's morning now, very early morning, so I think it's about time I can go see how they're coming along with the barn. Apparently they're done. It looks like they're done. As if I'd been gone for a week or longer. But anyway. Um, should I go in? I think uncle's in the corral there, but I wanted to go in. Um, not only does it look like they finished it, but it looks like they broke it in. It's been broke in, like, for a while. There's an apple core and cans. There's rotten hay everywhere. What? How long was I gone? <laughs> How long was I actually gone? How was your holiday? I was making money. And to think, you call me lazy. You've done a great job. Well, that crew did help. Oh, they had a the crew. house, a barn. Look at this place. <laughs> I can't believe it. Thank you. Thank you both. This calls for a drink. Young Miss at Dancing School has taught the minuet to tread. Young Miss at Dancing School has taught the minuet to tread. tread. But we go better when we brought our four tack to cat head. Come bustle, bustle, drink about and let us merry be. Our can is full, we'll pump it out and then all hands to see. When horn and hounds the forest rend, his pack the huntsman cheers. When horn and hounds the forest rend, his pack the huntsman cheers. As loud as halloo when we send a broadside uh -oh, to Mount Seer. they're getting Sears. drunk. As loud as halloo when we send a broadside to Mount Sears. Come bustle, bustle, drink about and let us merry be. Our can is full, we'll pump it out and then our hands to see. What's got at sea we spend on shore on sweethearts and our wives. What's got at sea we spend on shore at sweethearts and our wives. And then my boys hoist sail for more, thus passes sailors' lives. And then my boys hoist sail for more, thus passes sailors' lives. Come bustle, bustle, drink about, and let us merry be. Our can is full, let's fight it out, and then our hands to see. Yeah! <laughs> John! Get out here! Uncle's gone! <laughs> He's fine! Let me sleep. Get out here now! <sighs> that fat man will be fine. No, he won't. He's Skinner's. Uh oh. You think? Course. My guess is they went that way, but my other guess is they know we're coming after them. What choice do we have? None. <whistles> we just gotta keep our wits about us. We know this is a trap. Oh no! Jim. Let's go. I tracked them to the road. We'll pick up the trail there. Shit. It's like we forgot about them. We should have been ready. It happened. There's nothing we can do except try and get him back. We let our guards down for one moment. Hush. Up here. You see that? Blood. Dear Lord. They've gone up towards tall trees. 
That on. is a lot of blood. Yeah. John, look. We should agree on something. If it's really bad, this might not be about saving it. What the hell are you talking about? If it's really bad, it might be better to stop the pain. Jesus, you mean to... I mean, you can live a week without a scalp, but it ain't a good week. A gut wound, you can live a month, but it's horrible. What they've done to him might have killed him already, with only hurt to come. We get him, and we see, okay? We'll make it his call if we can. But it may be we have to decide. Okay? Okay. Uh-oh. Did you hear something? Huh? Oh! Yeah. You think they saw us coming? I don't know. I guess we'll soon find out. We'll be better off going on on foot. Okay. Leave the horses in the trees there. Hide at the holes. Stay. Stay. To the trees. Come on. I see them. Why does it always start raining when we do stuff like this? It's like a thing. Um, like they can't see okay. us? To the right. Uh huh. Two skinners. Look out. Probably. Take one. I'll take the other. Um. Do I have throwing? Uh, no, no. Do I have throwing weapon? Yeah, I have throwing knives. Okay. Can I th use the throwing knife from here? Oh, I'm supposed to be using my bow. That's what I'm supposed to be using. Quick, come on. I'm. Uh, hmm. Because John just knows how to use a bow. They're down. Move. You know, Arthur got lessons from Charles, sort of, but Arthur didn't. I mean, Arthur. They were did, waiting for us. But <laughs> Uncle should be close. John didn't. You oh better be. Names. Keep your head. We'll find him. Come on. Okay, let's do it. I'm screaming along. No, no, stay down. What are you doing? Hold. Patrol to our left. Shh. Kill the patrol. Or let them pat. We should probably. Easy. Easy. We should probably kill them. Let's, let's kill them. Charles, let's kill them. Let him go. No! I don't want to let him go because then they'll come up behind us. That's it. Patrol's taken care of. Yeah. And we're looking for something. Us, most likely. Come on. Let's find where they're holding him. Do they have arrows? Because I could use them. Yeah, thank you. Well, like, I mean, I have 38, so I guess. But you never know. Oh, horses, horses. Wagon. With a cage. Hold up. Oh, they're dragging him. Yeah. Oh. Wagon. There. It's dragging someone. Is it Uncle? No. Some other poor bastard. Let's follow. He might lead us to the camp. Oh, Keep dude. on him. I just don't, I don't want to get too close. Should we... Oh. Should we, uh, not try to help that poor guy? No, I guess not. He's stopping. What do you see? He's picking up... Poor bastard's dead. If he's walking with the body, we must be close. Let's take him down. Before he gets to the rest. Take him, John. Okay. <laughs> I can hear. I think I see something. Uh huh. You do? I can hear something. Yeah, that must be their camp. 
What do we do? Let's get up on that boulder, take a look. <sighs> Hang in there, old man. Okay, okay. I can't see much through this mist. Can you look too? Hold on. I am looking. There's like some dead bodies. I don't see any living ones. I hear. Am I supposed to be getting up on this? I can't. I can't get up there. <clears throat> it's it says to go around over here. Well, I'm just going where the yellow circle is telling me to. What am I supposed to do? I mean, I'm looking. Somebody's inside one of these little makeshift buildings, groaning, and it sounds like Uncle. There's a dead body. Like, there's a dead body right there. And there's one over there. What do you want me to do, Charles? Hmm? There's some dead bodies hanging there. Gross. I see no living people. There's a body on a rack. I can't see uncle. Charles. If I can't see anything from here, I should go somewhere else where I can see. Come over here. Get a better angle. Here. I'm trying to get a better angle. Charles. What better angle can I get from here? I've already done. I've already done it. The the circle's telling me to go this way. I'm not listening to you, Charles. Come over here. Can I get up there? Use the binoculars. I didn't think I needed to use the binoculars just because I, uh, you know, it's really close, but I guess I will use them. <sighs> oh, that's my god, uncle on the rack. We gotta go get him. Careful. Where are they? Where are they? I don't care. Come on! Charles! See, I knew I was supposed to get up on that rock. <laughs> Charles, look out! Different gun. Oh. There's a couple. Too late, too. I'm carrying. Come on, Uncle. 
I have a feeling I'm going to be shooting you. Because here come the rest. Quick! There's more of them. I'll cover you. Come on! Down that gully. Get me out of here. Why do I have to have this gun on me? Oh, come on. How many times do I have to shoot you before you fall? To the sk where the skitters are camped out all the Over time. Here. Almost back. Hang in there, old timer. <laughs> Does it look okay? Does it look okay? No, it looks pretty. Uh, I, can't, I can't hit my back. <sighs> Uncle. Uncle. Hey. <sighs> well, I can't move. I got you. I got you. Come on. Let's get him out. Oh, thank you, boys. Don't mention it. I thought I was dead. Don't get all sentimental now, old man. You know, I really think you're dying. It's gonna be okay. A few days, you're gonna be just fine. You're a survivor. Easy, easy. He's, you're not gonna go in with him? He'll be fine. Oh, we just left him in there, huh? You think they'll be back? Maybe, but I doubt it. We must have killed most of them. Now, this is your land. Was it theirs once? I don't think so. I met a fellow said the Skinners rode down about two years ago. They're just angry men on a rampage, and we got in their way. Sort of like we used to be? <laughs> yeah, exactly like we used to be. Maybe we should take up torture. <laughs> uh, we got Uncle singing instead of torture. We're gonna be safe here, John. Hmm? Yeah. You, your family, you all be safe. Yeah, if only. I hope so. I really do. If she ever comes back. <laughs> well. Poor uncle. Okay. Pick 
up them cans while you're at it. <laughs> Ranch life. Look at that. What the hell? You. You're. <laughs> I. You always did have that fine way with words. You doing all right, son? Sure, Pop. Can I go see the house? Sure. Give him some time. He'll warm up. It's quite a place you got here. It's yours. Ours. I should see about that boy. Who's my new rival? Oh, that's Rufus. He's loyal, dumb, and angry, so he reminded us of you. That's your idea of a joke, miss? I guess. Huh. Okay. Oh, and now we got two quests to do. All right. Well, here we are. Here we are. We got chickens now, sounds like. And a cow. There's a chicken coop. But there's no chickens in it. That looks like they're all running around loose. That's not a tall enough fence for chickens. They'd hop right over that. <laughs> it sounds like they did. <laughs> all right. What do we have here? We've got a fire. I. I'm assuming that's supposed to be like a blacksmith fire. It doesn't look like one. Oh, hey, we've got crops. I wonder how much time has passed. Well, he didn't grow a beard. Well, not a big one like he usually does. <laughs> what do we got growing out here? Looks like a couple different things. Hmm. Neato burrito. <laughs> Um, looks like I can do chores in here. I can do, um, fill up the jugs by milking the cow. We'll be all right in the middle of the walkway like that. They still haven't picked up the trash. <laughs> all right, so we got a cow. Hello, cow. I'm not going to do chores right now. I'm going to look around. Before milking the cow, clean out the stalls. Okay. Well, let's take a look at the map. Cause So we got Abigail wa wants to speak to me. Looks like Sadie is going to be here. According to the spoilerific picture. Jack could use some company. Okay. We'll have some time. So uh, why don't we go talk to one of them? Let's go talk to Jack first since that's, well, I don't know if that's less likely to be a big quest or not. I mean, it could be. Uh -huh. But the one with Abigail and Sadie is more likely the bigger one. I don't know. Who knows? I've been wrong before. What am I wearing? Hmm. Interesting. I want to go in the house and see how it's different now that uh, Abigail's moved back in, but uh, 
I'll activate their quest if I do. What are these little black dots everywhere? What are are these chores? Yeah, camp chores. Okay. I should go see what they are. I wanna yeah, before I before I do anything I'm gonna go see what these camp chores are, just because. I'm curious. I'm curious. Okay, chopping wood. Looks like. And then um The other one is... Picking up a sack. Where, where do we put the sack after we pick it up? Move it to the chicken coop. Really? I... Are, are we really going to be bothering ourselves with honor and stuff? this late in the game? I mean, we have four quests left to do. <laughs> There's only four quests left in the whole game. Or at least main quests. I don't know about like if there's any side quests and whatnot. Oh! You know what? I completely forgot about that mayor letter. I should check and see if there's a um, a quest to go talk to the mayor. I don't know if there is. So. This chicken coop doesn't have any doors on it. Okay. Lots of little individual boxes for the nests instead of one long one with compartments. Interesting. So here chick chick, I guess I'll just leave that there for you. Now I can feed oh okay, so now I can feed chickens. Which are somewhere. I hear them like way out here in the bushes. But apparently the bucket is here. Feed bag. Okay. So I can feed the chickens. Feed the chicken. Well no. Can I just park everything on the same side of the chicken coop? Could I not? There's no chickens in here! <laughs> okay. Now I can bring the egg cr crates to the wagon. Well, how about that? The invisible chickens have laid eggs in the crates. <laughs> uh, whatever. I'll try to suspend my disbelief, but I can't! I can't! <laughs> I'm a farm person. I've lived on farms. I've had chickens almost my entire life. This is agonizing for me! Sorry, you guys. <laughs> there! <laughs> now I'm just gonna leave them there and maybe we'll someday take those into town. That's a lot of eggs. So. Okay. Um, what is the other camp chore? Because that one we didn't do. Is it something having to do with crops? Oh, it's probably watering something. What is that? Use the water pump. Okay. Deliver water around the ranch. To like places. So there's like a. Um, what? I have to go in there. Well, how do I get in there? I have to go. Oh, there's a gate. Pour out the bucket.
All right. Awesome. What do I do with the bucket now? I, I, I take it back. Oh, I'm still doing it. I'm still in the chore. Right. Well. I don't know if I want to do the whole thing. I, I, I don't want to do the whole thing. <laughs> That's a lot of water. Um, let's look at the rest. I think that's the wood chopping, that's the grain, this was the something, there was something over here and that's the chicken coop, right? There's one over on the other side near Jack. Hmm. I suppose I can go check and see what it was. No, that was the wood chopping. The one over by Jack was the wood chopping, right? Wood chopping, grain, I don't know. Whatever. Maybe I won't uh, look for all of them. <laughs> Let's go talk to Jack next. How you getting on, son? Uh, fine, sir. What are you doing? Reading and uh, playing with the dog. You want to go fishing or something? Not particularly I don't really like fishing do like eating though right cuz we got to find some food <laughs> come on let's head this way to the stream there's a stream down here okay sir why you got to be like that I'm sorry it's okay do you wish I was more like you? Like me? No. But... Let's keep going. Can Rufus come fishing? Dogs scare the fish. But... If you'd like him to, I guess. So... You don't care if we don't catch fish? Yeah, I... I'm not very good at this. At... Fishing or walking? At talking with you. <laughs> but fishing will be fun. Sure. Unless you want nothing but beans again. No. I'd like to fish. And it'll be pretty fun, I promise. Okay. It's fine being out with you even though I can't say the right thing. And you, Pop. We should... Let's do more of this. Sure. I, I mean... Yes. I'd like that. Pretty countryside, ain't it? I guess. Grass and the light. There's a lot of ugly in this world, but sure as hell is a lot of beauty. Yes. You'll see it better when you get older tough at your age. Just land and light. But to me, it's 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 life. I, I can't explain it. <laughs> okay. What are you gonna be when you're old? This is a real good fishing spot. I suppose I should have walked always say that. And hours later, they've caught nothing. Ain't you just the leading authority on everything? Well, Ain't it so? Well, maybe. In this case, it's true. I hear there's some real big fish in here. Big old steelheads. Hard to catch, but real good eating. Hard to catch. Get your excuses in early. That dog of yours know he's owned by a complaining know-it-all? Come on, son. I'm sorry. No, you ain't. It's all right. Come on, let's fish. Oh, really? You're gonna give me another fishing lesson? Uncle Hosea, he was the fisherman, wasn't he? That's right. I remember Uncle Arthur taking me, though. It actually Arthur has been a while since I've done that. Did he? Huh. Yeah. I suppose he did. That's nice. 
I got a bite. I got a bite. All right. Now stay calm and start reeling them in. Not too fast. You want to set the hook in tight. He's he's strong. Good. Now reel him in. Stay calm. Give him a tug. Now reel. Both caught one at the same time. I got him. <laughs> That's a weird fish. What do you think? How you feel? <laughs> I don't. I feel. I don't know. Thanks, Dad. You keep that. I told you this was a good fishing spot. They're not very they big. They're just little bluegills. Hey, my trip with Arthur. I remember now. I picked some flowers, and a couple of men showed up, dressed like they was from the city. No one like that's gonna show up here. Thank the Lord. Yeah. Where's Rufus? How much you want to bet? I don't know. Relax. He's a dog. Where is he, though? I don't know. I'll go find him. Rufus! Come on, boy! Rufus! Um, should probably go, too. Let me come help you look. like him, Pa. Can you go search the other side of the track? Um. Rufus! Gee whiz, I wouldn't feel comfortable Rufus. about leaving him out here by himself Rufus. with all them Skinners around. I mean, Rufus. really? It's like the worst place to be right now. Rufus! Here, Pa. Dad! Please come here! They always send you in the opposite direction and then call you right back. Rufus! Snake! A snake. Come on! Rufus! Rufus! No! It's a snake! I see. He bit him! Calm no. down, boy. And Jack, you calm down too. Come here. What are we gonna do? Suck what are we gonna the do, venom Mom? out. Oh, okay. Get the poison out! It. Don't swallow it. <laughs> Duh. Well, suck it, Dad. Well, spit it out. You want to do it, Dad? Rufus, no. He's gonna die. He's gonna die. He'll be okay. We just gotta get him somewhere warm and calm. He's gonna die. Go get the fishing rods and the fish. I'm taking the dog home. I thought I put the fish in my pack. Abigail, can I get a hand? What, what's going on? Dog got bitten by a snake. Let's look after him and the boy. Grab his rug. Is it gonna be okay? Jack, the dog is gonna be just fine. We never should have gone fishing. Sometimes, sometimes, you just don't know how things are gonna turn out. But, but the dog. The dog's gonna be fine. It's okay, son. Oh. <laughs> it better be fine. Okay, well, that's the end of that one. <laughs> Who's this little tiny thing here? Hello. Who are you? This must be Jack's horse. <laughs> Got Morgan. That's a small Morgan. That's You're a all right. tiny, Thank you. tiny. I'd call that a pony. 
Okay, and now we've got another. Who's is this one? Who's is this horse? Oh wow! Oh look, the dog's okay. He's fine. Rufus, you're all right. Wow, that's a that's a thunderstorm suddenly come up. Hey, I want to see this new horse. There's actually. Kentucky Saddler. Oh! Fallmouth. That's Charles' horse. Where's. Um. There's another horse. Where's, um. Whiskers at? Don't see Whiskers. I can't actually. Touch this horse. I can just study it. No, that's the wrong one. I wanted to study this one. Okay, it's not very good stats, but I can't do anything with it anyways. I mean I can't like pet it or oh yeah I can. I can pet it. I suppose You're if I good boy. wanted to, I could um put my saddle on it and um, use it but I don't want to because I've already got I've got Rachel at um, for level for bonding and yeah Charles <clears throat> look at me working the white man's land for no pay how will let this happen? <laughs> Look, if if you need money, I'll get you money. <laughs> I'm just joking with you. Right now, this is good for me. And I know you do the same. You say the word, I'll be there. All right. <laughs> <laughs> he, has, he does have a free place to live, so yeah. He's earning his keep, I guess, is what it is. Well, there's Uncle. Let's go see how he's doing. What are you doing? Shh. You'll wake him. Heard a buffalo wouldn't wake him up. Oh, you're just gonna give up? You talk to him? Uh, get up. What time is it, John? You're okay. That's all I wanted to know. I need to get some shut eye. <laughs> I actually wasn't allowed to antagonize him. Alright, well, you guys, I think we're gonna call it a good episode for now. This is, uh, we've run out of time. The, seems like the ranch is coming along nicely. We've got chores, we've got new animals, we've got a garden, uncle's okay, Charles likes being here, the dog's alive, everything's going pretty darn good so far. Next episode, we will go inside and see how Abigail's, you know, probably swept. I'm hoping she swept, because if she didn't sweep... I will be... I just won't be able to believe in this game anymore, you guys. <laughs> if there's a woman living in that house and she didn't sweep, then somebody didn't do their homework. I'm telling ya. So, next week, we will see if she swept. Alright? Bye until then. <laughs>